Hi, this is Cass from Rosie Cass Plays, and welcome to episode season two, episode three, which is part forty-three of my one hundred vampire baby Hi. challenge. I wanted Lilith to come over so I could get a photo of her, but she won't because it's sunny, and I am a little bit annoyed about that. But you know, whatever. Fair enough. What? Lucas is still here. What? I thought he left. No, wait. Because I just invited someone else over. <laughs> All right. Can I? Oh, hang on. Now it's snowing. I don't want to upset Lucas because Lucas is number two baby daddy. I invited Chris Hemsworth over to be number three baby daddy. He got old. Um, I mean, I can't flirt with him now. I mean, she met him. Hey, Lucas. She met him when, like, when she was a child. So maybe that's a bit weird anyway. I'm going to go inside. I wonder if Lilith would come over now. You can come in. Ooh, he'd be a good fashion subject. That could actually be really fun. Because he... When I actually downloaded this sim, it was a, a five-star celebrity. I actually took all the celebrity levels off because I originally thought Lilith could uh, spend some quality time with Chris. Uh, didn't end up happening. They never actually met. So he's he's not been a daddy. Come in and use the toilet, sweetheart. It's fine. Um, well... That's not a toilet for you, Chris. Whatever. You do you, buddy. You do you. So, yeah, I just, I really wanted to get some photos of Lilith. And I'm kind of waiting. Ooh, the other thing that happened, our bills showed up and they are really expensive. So I knew this house was going to be expensive, but 10,000 simoleons expensive. So she needs to hustle on this photography thing because we cannot afford to stay here if we can't kind of get our income up and get it up fairly quickly. We can't afford to stay here. The other thing is that my stupid thing that I sent off to get approved hasn't actually come back yet. So, like, my photo of Lucas hasn't come back yet. So, yeah, that's great. Uh, so, Chris, could I get you to, like, come over here and we'll just take some photos of you? Because why not? You know, he would still be... I would still consider him as a baby daddy. <laughs> what? Right. That's a thing. It's happening. Yeah, I haven't been able to take a photo of Hannah yet either. See, that's kind of gross. Okay, I'm going to try and move this. I mean, he's not a bad looking elder. Yeah, let's just leave it at that. All right, buddy. What? Oh my God. Did that seriously make us friends? What? What just happened? He just became my friend from that. I took like four photos of him and he went from acquaintance to friend. So I guess we found a new way to like seduce people and skip that whole get to know you part. So I'm going to sell these. Thanks, Chris. You made me some money. We'll upload that. And I don't know. I'll keep this one because it's Chris Hemsworth. Uh, all right and i might make it black and white let's set a filter i don't really like black and white photos but actually what's the other sepia i like sepia better it just looks see how it's super oversaturated the game told me i didn't have enough light but i feel like there's enough light there now uh you can go buddy and i actually invite my mum over <laughs> um, i like to hang it current lot now all the vampires have appeared so, yeah. See you, buddy. We're friends now, though, so it's going to be super easy to, like, flirt with him. But I wonder if I could, like, pop these here. And then we could try using this thing instead. All right, we're going to give this a shot. So I'm going to ask Lilith to come here. Oh, she's got face mask on. Oh, sweetie. Okay, I think I fixed it. Let's see how we go. So we're going to take a picture of Lilith. And then I'd like to take a picture with Lilith, actually. this I'm basically killing time till she has this baby. She's thinking about nappies, so that's the thing that's happening. Come on, sweetie. Take the photo, Hannah. 
Your mom's getting bored, Hannah. This is really annoying. This feels kind of glitchy. Okay, I don't know what's happening here. I'm just going to speed it up and see if anything happens. Hmm, no, no. Apparently we're just standing here. So we're going to reset everybody. We're going to... Maybe it's because it's using the mark. Maybe that's the problem. Take a photo of... And now Lilith has disappeared. Excellent. This is going really well, you guys. I'm really, really pleased with this. I'm pleased I spent money on it. Okay, yes, I'm being cranky now. <laughs> Come on. I just wanted a picture of Lilith. I just wanted a nice picture of Lilith. I didn't feel like that was asking so much, you know? So I gave up on the photography, you guys. It was a bit annoying. Uh, I'm just having her come out and harvest all of the harvestables. Sell her bees. And then I actually want to harvest the plasma fruit and keep it. Which actually is working this time. That's exciting. Uh, okay, we're a little bit on fire. So I guess that's all of the harvesting we're doing for now. Uh, I might have her do some dark meditation. Where are you, girly? It feels weird not having kids. Like, I know I said that sort of towards the end of Lilith's tenure as well. Like, it just, I'm so used to this challenge being like constant kind of look after the toddlers and look after the babies and... Yeah, it feels weird that she's kind of just kicking around the house waiting. I mean, I could, in theory, have Chris come back over since everything was a bit of a bust with Lilith and it's now daytime and I can't invite her over again. I am going to keep trying, but I'm going to do it off camera because that was really quite frustrating and you guys don't need to hear me swear. <laughs> That's basically what I'm saying. So it's fine. I'm going to have her have a shower. Actually, let's take a steamy shower. And then we'll invite Chris over again. Uh, actually, nope, not that guy. Not that guy. Mm -mm -mm, Chris Hemsworth. Let's see if we could make, and I think actually if he is amenable to woohooing, maybe he should be my baby. Puh. Maybe he should be baby daddy number two. And the reason I say that is because he's an elder. Sorry, Lucas. Bit busy. Um, yeah, because he's an elder, I don't want him to like, um, die <laughs> before we can, you know, take advantage. Uh, can we start with a little beguile? Of course, she's in her third trimester, so this could be a really bad idea. But, yeah, we'll see. He's feeling confident. Is he... Now he's feeling flirty. That's good. Maybe we could just... Can we sit and chat here? The reason I want to do that is because Lucas has been tending to just turn up at my door and I don't, even though we're currently, I think, undercover. Actually, is there a, yeah, there is. There's a cover for that balcony, so she wasn't getting burnt. But at the same time, she, um, yeah, I just don't want her, like him rocking up and then we ruin all that hard work that we did. We're getting a sexy pose. We're going to flirt. You better not be getting on my computer, Chris. Don't make me bite you. Compliment his appearance. We're going to ask about his career. The maids downstairs. Invite to feel the baby. She looks really big in the belly department. Oh, he's a superstar with no fame. That's fine. How come I can give him the residence keys, but I didn't get that option with Lilith. Anyway, it's very strange. What's it like being an ex-celebrity? Maybe he used to be. Maybe when he retired, he was a superstar. Because look, a superstar at Plum Bob Pitches Crew. Uh, maybe he, like, retired and he doesn't do the celebrity thing anymore. I mean, that would make sense. Offer him a rose. Uh, no. I'm actually thinking, I love Slice of Life, but I might delete the acne portion of the mod. Because... I find it's really disruptive to the, like, they're putting on face masks at inconvenient times, they get acne in the middle of their wedding ceremony, which happened to lay in my, 
What did he just do? Yeah, in my Island Dreaming Let's Play, they, um, like, Lay got a pimple halfway through the wedding ceremony. It just <laughs> was there. It wasn't there before. Sorry if you guys can hear my dogs barking, by the way. Um, yeah, and I'm like, why? Why? Kiss hands. All right, let's seal the deal, buddy. Oh, we can't. Uh, we did first kiss, right? Woohoo in closet. Why can we have woohoo in the closet but not the bed? I mean, if that's his kink, that's fine. I understand, but that's weird. That's weird, right? All right, this is her first closet woohoo. First closet woohoo. First closet woohoo. Maybe it's when he was like a celebrity for real. Maybe he, yeah. <laughs> Maybe this was a thing that happened, you know, taking advantage when you're out and about and some cute sim fan is like, hey, it's Chris Hemsworth. And he's like, hey, she's cute. Maybe, maybe I'm just saying closets, you know, coat racks kind of at venues. Perhaps that's just his thing. Maybe. Just saying. So, <laughs> she's still not in labour. I'm basically waiting for her to go to into labour at this point. After the disappointing start with the whole photography thing, I kind of just want to get the whole baby thing sorted. I should pick a name. I do still have a list of names from when Corby... Corby, from when Willow, uh, wait, let me try that again. From when Lilith was having babies, Willow, got, his name popped up in the corner and I got confused. Did you guys just notice how she got a reputation boost from that? She got a reputation boost. She came out, stood here, and got a little positive reputation boost from woohooing Chris Hemsworth. I have questions, Your Honor. How does that happen? Oh my gosh. Hannah will always remember her first time. That wasn't her first time. She did have a coat hanger issue, but that's all right. She's feeling confident from exchanging numbers. It could be the start of a beautiful relationship, but it's not. All right, so what were we working on? I'm going to get a bat form just because it is useful for, like, getting out of the sun in a hurry. That's, frankly, the main thing I use it for. Because being able to do this and fly here is bat, very good. Very good. Strongly recommended. Come on, go into labour. Oh, my God. He's working out. Good work, buddy. Don't die. <laughs> uh, yeah, you should probably get going. That's true. Okay, you guys, so Lilith came back. We still haven't gone into labor. I took a ton of photos of her, but I've been uploading them to Simstagram and we just got our first point of fame. So I thought uh, these ones are super cute. I'm going to keep one of those, maybe both. So yeah, that's apparently a thing we're doing now is being a celebrity. So I also really like this one. That's an everyday wear shot. Uh, I'm going to sell that. Basically what I'm looking for here are examples of different types of outfits that we could um, use for future kind of tasking, I guess, if that makes sense. Plus I also obviously wanted a photo of Lilith, but oh my God, we've got into labor. Finally, that's awesome. I'm very excited. All right, so let's just get straight to it. We're going to go have the baby at the hospital and I'm going to invite Lilith to come because I don't really care about the baby daddies. But this is like the first because she's mean. She's not even going to try. Lilith tried because Lilith wasn't mean. But Hannah's mean. She's not going to care. She's like, eh, you know, we had some fun, but they're not going to be involved really. So why bother? Uh, so, yeah, whether Lilith will stay will depend if they fix that glitch, really. Uh, apparently they were actually going to. Oh, Lilith, don't be sad. I know. Oh, Nelani's a doctor now. Don't be sad. I know. Oh, she left. I know that you used to come here all the time. And I know there's people here that you used to like. Oh, we never did have a baby with Stanley, did we? We were going to. Is he a doctor? That's a very funky haircut for an elder. He's the nurse. Nalani's the doctor. Maybe they were going to give us female doctors because every time Lilith got a male doctor, she brought him home. <laughs> Just saying. All right. Can I, like, 
check in. That'd be great. This hospital's gotten quite glitchy, I have to say. I was kind of hoping that with a new matriarch, some of the glitches might go away, but it's the same save file, so I don't know who I'm kidding. I suspect the machine won't work properly. It hasn't worked properly since, like, the first, second or third labour. But you guys, this is going to be baby number 19. Fingers crossed if we're lucky, a vampire, which would make it the 16th vampire. So we're watching super close. Our doctor is Fetisha. I shouldn't that's how you say that, as opposed to Fetia. That sounds horrible. Fetia. Fetisha, I like it. It sounds fancy. She is a medical intern. Awesome. Now, I do have a list of baby names here. Oh my gosh, the machine's working. It's fighting. Um, is it meant to do that? I think I liked it better when it didn't work. <laughs> That's squirting stuff. Oh my goodness. I don't know how I feel about this. Yeah. Maybe, yeah, maybe it was a little thing. <gasps> it's a girl! It's a girl! All right. I'm thinking, I was contemplating doing A to Z names. So first baby is A, second baby is B, and just work through. So I have like three A names on my list. We have Abigail, Aurora, and Amelia. I might go Amelia. There we go. In honour of Doctor Who and our very first baby certificate. I thought I saw a baby sim a vampire symbol. Yay! That's so exciting. Alright, let's meet our little one. I'm seeing brown eyes, I think. I would feed you, but you're about to teleport away. All right, we are parenting level one. Well, we've started parenting level one. All right, let's go home and feed our little one. So not twins, but that's not like super surprising. We didn't buy fertility or anything, so we'll see. All right, we're home. Let's go find our little peanut. We're going to fly here as a bat. And she's not crying, but I've learned from past mistakes that that's a glitch because the babies are always meant to be crying when they get home. So inevitably, if I don't feed her, I'll get a message saying that we, like she's about to be taken away. So I'm gonna talk, I'm gonna rock, I'm gonna make a silly face, and then we'll change the diaper when we need to. And I'm so excited, we've got our first baby. You guys, it's our first baby, oh my God. First of many. Let's see if she can beat 18, hey? Given we're not currently on the uh, vampire aspiration, there's not really a lot pushing me towards levelling her up as a master vampire. Where is she at now? So she's almost, actually, she's almost at minor. So, you know, she's still working her way through it. Like, I'm not planning on not levelling her up as a vampire. I'm not going to avoid it. The reason I had Lilith on the Master Vampire track was because I thought it would keep me honest. I don't think I'm going to need it, so I'm going to play around with other aspirations. But if it gets to the point where I feel like I'm ignoring it, I might switch her across. So that's the plan. But I'm going to end this part here with our happy little mama rocking her baby. If you've enjoyed, like and subscribe. You know the drill. And I will catch you next time. Thanks for watching.